Are there any worth over 10 in here? Is there any worth over 10? Yes. If you look them up on eBay, it's probably half of them Yeah, okay. Good morning, guys. We have got a massive morning ahead. We're down here at Carrara Markets, one of my favorite places to source items to sell onto eBay. A little bit of a challenge today. I'm gonna to be starting with $200 cash and I'm gonna be trying to turn that into $1,000. If I can do that, I'm gonna be doing a giveaway at the end of the video. So, should be a fun morning. Looking forward to getting stuck in. The rush, the rush has begun, guys. If you've never watched a flea market video of mine, you won't know that this is the most important hour of the day. And uh, we're going to do some, some early work here. So come along with me and um, we'll try and grab the best items first. Which of these foot rock? A dollar. Flat. A dollar each? A dollar each. Five dollars. Is that yours? Yeah. Did you do 30? Yeah, I'll do 35. Looking for number 21. 21 would be great. First buy of the day, guys. Um, I've actually gone ahead and I've spent a quarter of our budget, which I'm a little bit nervous about, but not really, because there's some good stuff in here. Um, firstly, I'll talk about these. This is the book series of Foot Trot Flats, and there's a number of different uh, editions that we've got here. I mentioned in the video, uh, in the clip there, that I was looking for volume, I think 21. Um, that could be worth about 100 bucks on its own. Um, but these books here will all go for about $10 each. And I've got a number of different issues as well. I think this is probably the best stack. And at $10 each, that can go for about $120 odd dollars. So I think in total value, there's gonna be about 150 bucks. Because we've got 15 books, we paid $15. And that's gonna be 150 in value to kick us off. These shoes are the Nike Dunks and they're the Sun Club. Uh, Nike Sun Club there, so I think we can get about 100 for these as well. And we bought them for 35. So we'll make that a total of 250, and we paid 50. So 50 into 250, it's not a bad start. We've spent a quarter of our money, but we're also a quarter of our way to our goal. Let's get back in there. Oh, you're gonna be a rare flight. Hey, Doris. 20. You good? Yeah, not too bad, mate. Are there any worth over 10 in here? Is there any worth over 10? If you look up them up on eBay, probably half of them Yeah, okay. No, that's what I was going to do. Matt, if it's 15 or under, I price it at 5. Alright? 15 or under at 5, yeah, okay. 15 or under, I price it at 5 because I don't fuck around with that stuff. I want it gone. I know, I know you do. You might come back and buy whatever's left. Change. Um, I sell everything that's left to the Friendly Bricks for free. For three? So, best bet is to go through it now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. How much on Mario Kart race? Did you do 15? Ah, my pass. Scratches. What do you got there, mate? Big. It's like a gun on the Transformers masterpiece. Nice. Killing. How you doing, yeah, mate? Good, mate. How's things? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad? You're back again? Yeah, second time. Love it. <laughs> um, your DVDs? Um, 150. 150. How many you reckon are there? Oh, I don't know. It's it's really oh did ya? How about 50 on that? 70. 60? 
In the middle of 60? Oh. <laughs> Why don't you coin flip 50, 70? <laughs> 60? <laughs> yeah, right, I'm going to it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I've just been crunching some numbers here, and this is a pretty good buy off Dane. Uh, recycled kits. I'm just going to put his little Instagram page uh, off to the right-hand side of the screen here. Make sure you give him a follow because he has got unbelievable stuff, and he brings it down to the flea every now and again. And a lot of the boys, I think actually Jack's today cashed in and bought a stack of jerseys off him. Um, Dane was the guy that we bought the GWS jersey and the Brisbane Broncos jersey a couple of weeks ago and they went on to sell for $500. So a big, big thank you to Dane. Um, we bought these off him today and we've got this one here, the Henderson Kids. And this was selling volume one and two for $40. Um, so I'm going to go for about 20 bucks on that one there. Inspector Rex, this is the best of the bunch. Season one to eight, we should be able to get $100 for that. Now there are more seasons of Inspector Rex to try and find. But season one to eight, comps on eBay for about 100. So there's 120. Alias is one that I've sold a number of times before, and this is actually a complete set of one to five. Uh, so we should get about $40 for that one there. There's 160. The middle, we've got four seasons there. It's not complete, but we should get about 40 bucks for that as well, 200. And then we've got two seasons of a show that is quite underrated by DVD sellers out there. We've got season three and we've got season two of SpongeBob. Now, if you find a full eight series of that, it can go for upwards of about 120 bucks. So I'm gonna go for about 15 a piece. We're gonna list that up for about $30. So $230 in DVDs, that brings us up to a total of $480. We're just off halfway, uh, but we've spent another 60 bucks. So we've spent 110 and we're up to 480. So we're slightly off pace, but I'm pretty confident with a few more purchases out here today, we can keep this momentum rolling and get ourselves back to where we need it to be. Got that for at, the, at a booth, 50 bucks, like comp up for easy 200. Easy 200. Easy 200. Especially with its box as well, that's yeah. a great buy. And then um, we've got heaps of other games and stuff, really cheap. Yeah, you have too. Is that off Reese? No, I got it off some other dude, I don't know. <laughs> some good games in there. heaps of uh, clothes and stuff off the dude as well. How much did I pay for it? How much did I pay for it? Yeah. 50. Ooh. Steel, hey? Oh, yes. <laughs> Where did you get the game from? I got the games uh, from Ruth over there, but they already uh, stocked out. I've no, no. Oh, thank you. No worries. See, you're just getting the good Popular stuff. Items. You're just getting the good stuff. <laughs> How much on the shoes? Oh, 15 on the shoes. 15? Both pairs as well, those two. Yeah, just a pair of them as well. All right. All right, now I'm gonna have to do some maths on these because I haven't worked out the numbers just yet, but I'm very happy with the purchase of these. These are a pair of Nike golf shoes. They were a US size nine, and the guy was offering about $15 a piece for these, and 15 for these as well. So we're about 30 bucks in, and the comps that I was seeing on eBay for the golf shoes was about 80 odd dollars. And then these toasty uh, Air Force Ones, the greens, uh, we should get about 60 to 80 dollars i'd say for those as well um, so let's call it 150 dollars in value so we're up to a total value of 630 dollars and we've now spent 140 dollars so we've got 60 bucks to play with and we need to turn that into 370 bucks it could be tough but i'm confident how much on the shoes i'm good how are you doing I reckon these three are probably the most of interest. Those ones, these ones, and them. So I'll do um I do twenty on the brooks. Twenty on the brooks? I do twenty on those as well. Yep. And probably thirty five on those. Thirty five on those. Yeah. I would go fifteen, fifteen, twenty. I can do 20 on all of them. 20 on all? Yeah. Is that the same? So 20, yeah, 20 and 25. Yes. How much your books? Um, $2. $2. Yeah. I'll keep an eye on these, but I'm here all day. Okay. So I will be back. But thank you, though. That's all right. How you been? I'm good. You good? 
Timmy warns him. Hey, hey. Oh. Hey, hey. 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 Hey, hey.